You're the type of guy to suck on the harmonica <laughs> instead of blow it. You know what I mean? Come on, give us a give us a harmonica reverse. Can I, uh, <laughs> can I blow it this way? <laughs> Dancing in the middle of the club. Window shatter. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another video. I am excited. Actually, I'm 50 50 excited right now. Oh, Brandon is driving. He's been driving since 5 a.m. to get to us all the way in South Florida right now. 5 a.m. With a boat full of, like, I mean, a bunch of random stuff. We have a bunch of random stuff. That I bought last night that I almost got arrested for because I thought that was stealing at Walmart. <laughs> We're about to do a, a Big Mama Sauce, Mima, Big Bibbidi Gill survival yeah. video. And Brandon is facilitating everything. I don't know what's happening, how it's going to work, but we're going along with it. And we're meeting him in nine minutes in the Everglades. Oh. Oh my God. <laughs> There you go. You were <laughs> close to the electric. <laughs> Hi. Hey, Brandon. It's good to see you. Good to see you too. Uh, I was actually about to call you. Oh. Oh. Do you have a pin? Oh. A pin? That this thing can't do donuts. I don't think it's got enough power to do donuts. This is when you just say you're sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I got in trouble. I, I don't think this thing really does donuts. I mean, we were honestly just driving in circles so cool. at like a very slow speed. Am I supposed to be seeing this now? You can see you can see a few items. It felt like it's so secretive, dude. Like he's like dealing like secret back here. Dude. It's been a while since I've had one of these, but oh my goodness. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I brought my harmonica. Dude, that thing, so, you know, normally, you're the type of guy to suck on the harmonica <laughs> instead of blow it. You know what I mean? Come on, give us a give us a harmonica reverse. Can I, uh, can I blow it this way? Oh. <laughs> So I brought a harmonica, so when we're at the campfire tonight, roll the clip. I'll be playing the harmonica for everybody. There's only two trees on the island and everything's been rainy, so I don't even know if we have firewood. <coughs> Maybe I was playing it in the dark. He's just by himself. <laughs> I brought a few other things, I'll show them later. This is one of my favorites though. That's now, it? No, no, that's all you get to see right now. I brought a lot of other stuff. Jesus, bro. Now, let's see what you brought. Thank God you brought your survival harmonica. <laughs> Dude, I hope to God we don't get stranded and Brinton's on the front of the boat just like, boom, boom, boom. I can just see that being a clip and I, God, I hope that doesn't happen. Oh, all right. Well, obviously we're not taking this boat because. Um, you didn't bring a boat? I didn't bring a boat. I didn't. <laughs> My Volkswagen Jetta, unfortunately. <laughs> Dude, there's not enough room for me to sit down. Let oh alone God. four people. Big men. We're already overweight. I put these on today just for you, dude. Oh, oh, yeah, do I a did. little bit of... <laughs> oh. Did I get the explosion oh, after that, I did that? No. Oh, no. no. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I'm uh, I'm stoked. We're doing a lot tonight. I at least know we're bow fishing. Excuse me. Oh. What are we doing? <laughs> what are we sleeping in? We'll figure that out later. No, no, no. That's that's a little special. Top secret. It's not top secret. It's just not to flex, but <laughs> I bought the world's largest inflatable tent. Ooh. I'm experienced with inflatable tents. I thought you were just gonna stop at inflatable. <laughs> All right, we're gonna load this thing up and ourselves, and we're gonna get on plane. Uh, hopefully not sink. Hopefully not sink. Yeah. <laughs> 
Survivor Island. <laughs> the only place with trees in the Everglades. And we freaking made it. You thought I was feeling you? <laughs> that, a <I'm> munch. <laughs> We are extremely deep in the Everglades right now. And by the way, the Everglades is one of the more deadly places in North America. And this is about one of the only spots that has land. There's there's very few adult marsh. You can't really get around. It's full of alligators. I mean, full. I'm sure we will see plenty of alligators. I don't like that. But I, this is why I have an eggplant, because this is like alligator repellent. I looked that up on Google, and uh, there was, I found a Reddit feed about how it use eggplants as alligator repellent. They don't like them. Um, they prefer smaller items, and this is quite large. <laughs> that is why I brought this. I mean, you're going to see me keep this on me all day. Right, alligator comes. No! Daddy, chill. What would you do? Right there. We're about to pull up on our base of land. Don't eat it. Oh. That's for the... Oh my Where's god, it? that's for the gator. Where's that's it? for the gator. The repellent is gone. No, it's not. Oh my no. goodness. Perfect. All right, boys and girls, we have made it. Actually, you're probably wondering what this stuff is. So this is an abandoned island in the glades that was founded by George Washington. Um, I'll give you guys a little bit of a history lesson. Yeah, founded by George Washington back in 1746. Uh, some of the first settlers came here and they cleaned up the place. This is actually, this is history right here. This is one of their fires. All the kids watching, that's what I'm saying. This is, uh, you probably learned about this in school, so. This is the world's largest- Oh God, it's tripping. Oh. It's also the world's heaviest it is inflatable house. The world's largest inflatable house. Yeah. It's literally ripping. Wow, that's not good. Here we go. Ready? That's it, dude. Um, before we open it, I do want to say this. Should we make icons? <laughs> Down the middle. Oh, <laughs> that's even worse. <laughs> it says it comes with certain things. I didn't ever open it because I knew once I opened it, I would never get it back in. So, with yeah. that being said, it's an inflatable house. So you have to pump it up and there should be a pump in there. If there's not, we're oh actually screwed. Oh my God, dude. I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't look like there's a pump in there. Brandon, there's not a pump in there. There's gotta be. We could be screwed. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Oh you. my God, there might not be a pump. By the way, like this isn't no ordinary pump. <laughs> Package content, tent, carry bag. It's a hand pump. No, a hand pump. It's just a house, dude. All right, it's just a house, dude. All right, that's probably the pump. <laughs> dude, <laughs> dude, I could have brought a pump. I got an electric pump. All right. Yeah. Oh my. We got a pack. We're screwed. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, bro. You're kind of inflating the whole thing. Oh! She's listening, dude! Keep going, Brittany. Let's go! Keep going, Brittany. No roof! No roof! Keep no going, Brittany. Keep going. Let's go, Brittany! I really hope it's not three feet tall. I really hope. Oh, I dude. Really why does it look really short? I feel like we've been bamboozled. <laughs> oh my god, dude, this is it. Wait, I think it gets a little taller. No way. How? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it does. It does. It gets like a foot. So, dude, I basically think I filled the volume of air up and you just tightened up there. You know? No, no, no. I did all that. <laughs> tent become a tent when I started pumping. I'm not gonna lie. I was like, how the hell did I just pump for so long and he just goes goes a little bit and the whole tent disappears? <laughs> oh, daddy. Is she almost done? You. I'm not gonna. Lie. Yeah. Oh. All right. Yeah. It's as hard as a rock. <laughs> this is awesome. I can literally stand up. Oh wow! It looks like I'm in a. It looks like. <laughs> it looks like I'm in one of the. Looks like I'm in a sauna. There's a root here, bro. We should have checked the bottom. Some lava rock. <laughs> We decided instead of hammers, it's easier to just add weight by getting on each other's shoulders and then it cinches the things down. <laughs> How are you better. gripping him like that? <laughs> wow. Oh, Lord, All right, this is baby mama right here. I mean, dude, like this is sick. Oh my gosh. This is the world's largest inflatable tent. Thanks, Brandon, by the way, because Brandon bought this. I didn't have to buy it this time. I, did, I didn't have to spend multiple thousands of dollars on an item. This is phenomenal. And he even provided us with a, dude, this is the most luxury sleep I'm probably ever gonna get. Home sweet home, dude, I love it. <laughs> This is about as bougie as, I, like I said, I think we've ever been. Thanks to Brandon. Mr. Bougie here. This is all, this is all Brandon. Look at this. We have uh, what I like to call uh, our food accommodation center 
formerly known as the kitchen. Sure. That's yeah, a really expensive chair. By the way, never in my life would I spend that much money on a chair, <laughs> just so you guys know. I mean, that, dude, I'm talking like that is a good $350 chair. Oh my goodness. Crazy, right? A chair, a seat. Dude, you could use anything as a seat. Dude, know, it doesn't even look special. Yeti made chairs. Other than that, I mean, this is the biggest inflatable tent you can buy on Amazon. It is it's massive. I don't think y'all understand how big it is. The camera doesn't ever do justice never. when it comes to size. Trust me, I know. <laughs> I try with the angles as much as I can. <laughs> Use 0.5, start at the base. Oh. 0.5, start at the base. Crazy. For everyone, anyone who needed a good it recommendation. It's very pointy when it gets there, but dude, it's like from here to there. You know Can I do that on the, the can cannon? Can yeah, that's what I, I, I do this. Like typically, I just go like this right here. We've got a bad ass over here. Good to know. Other than that, uh, <laughs> what what are the things? Python. Pythons. All right, so alligators, pythons. Other type of snake. Uh, other type of snake, spiders. Getting lost. <laughs> getting, getting lost. Um. Everglades man. Um. What? <laughs> no, yeah, so it's cold. It's cold outside. The water is colder than the air, so the alligator is going to move on to land. Well, we are the only hard land in like 20 miles, for real. Oh. This is it. That's why this cool. is called Survivor Island. So if the alligators are going to conjugate anywhere, it's going to be right where our tent is. So we should be seeing some of those. And, and there's massive pythons out here. There is even a very small population of anacondas. There's I, also little pythons out here. There's also little pythons out here. <laughs> Just saying, there's probably two on this island at least. <laughs> I'm one of them. <laughs> and I'm not. When the real stuff's gonna go down is when it starts to get dark. Oh, we can yeah? That's what I was thinking. There we go. Oh. Wow. Air. Oh. Air. We got the freaking oxygen, boys. It was like breathed in whatever's inside this burger. Oh, yeah. I, that burger has been in me. What? Um. Mmm. <laughs> I'm going to give it a three. Well, that looks like it sucks, but this, this is dinner for champions. This is the appetizer right here. This isn't what the main meal is tonight. At least that's what I think, right? Right, Brandon? I'm not gonna lie. I... We might be screwed. Is this tent about to explode? No, the propane is, though. Oh, okay. It keeps going out. Never mind. There's an alligator right there. How, how big do you think that is? Probably like a niner. Nine, nine footer, nine foot alligator. Yeah, dude. Um, Why do you say niner like it was some casual, bro? That is it. Oh, it's coming this way. Come here. Showed up to camp. Oh my God, he's coming right to me. I know, that's kind of a problem. Come here. Dude, this gator is literally coming like directly to us. Come here. Oh, he's coming. That's not good. I mean, now we just know that gators are little. I mean, literally, he's right here, and camp is right there, and we're gonna be staying on the ground. So, dude, that gator is. I mean, it's like it's like eight feet from me right now, and it's a nine foot alligator. Come here, Heath. Oh, he has an overbite. That is so cute. He has a little overbite. Oh. I, I don't feel bad about it. I'm not gonna lie, the tent it might be the most majestic thing I've ever seen in my life. Like it looks like it's it should, insane. It looks like it should be like a wallpaper yeah. on a phone. That's it, how cool. Yeah. George, uh, she's still sitting over there. She's literally just lurking over there, waiting to come up and get the fire when we're done. Uh, other than that, I think the next step is to uh, we're gonna load up the old boat and we're gonna make a freaking catch and cook happen. And by catch it, I mean shoot it with a bow and arrow. <laughs> oh, oh, baby. I've only ever bow fished one time in my life, and uh, it took me about 95 shots before I got a tilapia. <laughs> Three. <laughs> oh, no. oh, there's one. There's go. Under him. Under him. Oh. You didn't get him, so you might as well miss him by a mile. But it was close, <laughs> bro. <laughs> when we one, two, three it. Eventually, we're gonna get one, and it's gonna. We're just gonna edit it to make it that the only clip. Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> this is bad, dude. This is 
This is as bad as it gets right here. We need salt. Uh, I combined with Brandon and I have missed how many shots would you say? Um, at least a hundred together. <laughs> <laughs> like, literally, right now. Like the fish don't even need to be afraid. Like yeah. just stay where you're at. We've missed this many times. <laughs> That's not okay. <laughs> that was half of Last one. Did we get her? We did it. Oh my God. For the love of God. No. Please. Please God. I didn't get it. They're everywhere up here. They're not everywhere. They're everywhere. <laughs> oh, yeah. I got him. Yes. I got him. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, dude. Oh. Yes, bro. Thank God. Oh my gosh. I know. Listen. Listen. I know. <laughs> you don't have to please. I'm not entirely sure how these work, but I got these and I thought this would make a good addition. Okay. They are bumblebee starlights <laughs> oh that will go in, but they're they're pretty long. <laughs> dude, that's like a that's like a beehive, dude. What do you got going on there? <laughs> no no no, this is this is for you. We just need to unwrap them. I actually love them, dude. Yeah, it's like little twinkle lights. Well dude. we can hang them along up there. <laughs> and we can look at them. <laughs> it looks like the topper of a Christmas tree, this, dude, doesn't is it? Is this supposed to be a beehive? <laughs> I thought it was a strand of beehive. And and here I, I might have been wrong this whole time. <laughs> I, I think it is. Dude, Dude give me one of them. Ah! You got it. Yeah. <laughs> oh God, boys, that was good. Uh, <laughs> Brandon, shut the up. Oh. Is one of the greatest nights of my life. I love the Bumblebee Starlights. I didn't think they were gonna be this good. They are phenomenal. We gotta get this thing in the boat now. Should I take it over there? I hope you didn't come to my cabin. There it is. Let's get out of here. Let's blow this stand. <laughs> Wait, was that, was that it? Is that how no. it goes? It never was like that. It was never like that. It wasn't like that. Oh my God. Let's get off this island. Okay, interesting thing we missed yesterday's upload. You want to know why? Is because we were in another country and we didn't get back until 1 a.m. last night. And and not only that, I have a mustache right now. That's how you know the video is good if I have a mustache. It's one of those videos that like it, it takes a lot to do and it came out really well. Yeah. That's gonna be the next one, which I am so excited to drop. Other than that though, thank you guys. This was a, a luxury mission with Brandon. That's pretty much what it was. We were asked to come along and we filmed it. I didn't shoot a fish. Uh, I, I missed. You suck. I, I I miss, I miss every time. <laughs> Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I love all of you. Click the subscribe button down below. Other than that, I'll catch you guys on that next episode of Fanatic. Peace. Oh my, that is a, it's a, like a personal tank. I've been trying to buy one of these on Facebook Marketplace for you guys. It's called a, it's called an Argo. If I can get next to it, if this wasn't a one line. Dude, we're about to pull some fast and furious <laughs> steal this thing. Oh, That's what we're about to do. <laughs> hey, uh, Traff, can um, when we edit this, just remind me to edit the part out where Brenton does this, and then let's get it going. Oh, dude, look at it, dude! I pumped it up, bro. Oh my we goodness. Got a little bit left. Oh we got my a goodness. A little bit left to pump up, bro. It's for like editing, a couch, dude. for me to edit tonight. Oh, I'm game. I'm good. I don't think uh, you're gonna have any time to edit tonight, buddy. Dark. Oh. Buddy. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. That's when the real stuff goes down. <laughs> Not like we just drove 20 miles deep into the Everglades, set up a whole house. Not real enough. <laughs> still up. Not real. Sorry, guys. Do it again. I like my wiener in a potato bun. Since we're talking about aesthetic, not only do we have beautiful mood setting bumblebee lights, very easy on the eyes. I actually love yeah, that. Yeah, this is if very nice. Out of our front window, we have a nice popping campfire. 20,000 likes. Brinson was spear. Agar. No, I won't. <laughs>